Welcome to LaunchGuard's Daily Security Byte. I'm Corey Knockreiner. Today I'm covering OpenSSL's latest security patch. Over the last few days, the InfoSec community has been abuzz about the pre-notification for OpenSSL's latest update, which supposedly was going to fix a highly critical vulnerability. After flaws like Heartbeat and the recent Freak, everybody's really focused on OpenSSL updates. Anyways, on Thursday, OpenSSL released the update, and while it does fix a number of security flaws, two of which they assign a critical rating, it's not as bad as many people had worried. The biggest vulnerability only affects version 1.0.2 of OpenSSL, and it's a DOS flaw. Without getting into all the specifics, essentially an external attacker that can access your OpenSSL server can actually stop it from responding to further connections. And while this is a significant vulnerability, if you have have a critical OpenSSL server, many people use older versions of OpenSSL. Besides that, they also changed the severity of the freak vulnerability, the one involving the RSA export uh, cryptography cipher. Apparently, more people use this particular cipher than the OpenSSL folks first thought. Besides that, there's a number of other moderate uh, OpenSSL fixes too, while though important, are not critically important to everybody out there. Now, the takeaway here is still simple. If you use OpenSSL, you do want to patch. But if you don't use the latest version, 1.0.2, you may have a little more time to actually patch. You don't have to do it very aggressively. By the way, WatchGuard customers out there can feel comfortable knowing that the highest severity denial of service vulnerability does not affect us. In any case, that's the news for today. Thank you for watching.